I'm just waiting for the big hit when uh, the bad guys really come on strong and really disrupt everything. And I, you know, it th- will be this. It will be this year. I promise you. This year, really? It will be this year. All right, that was John McAfee back in June claiming the big one was coming. Now he says the Sony hack was the big one. Now John demonstrated for us exactly how he says it was done. We recorded this during a commercial break in our last hour. Take a look at this. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, call into your voicemail system, hack into your voicemail, and your voicemail system is going to call you. You may think that's weird. Uh, but in a few minutes, the phone will ring, and it says that voicemail is calling you. Uh, whether or not you answer yeah, that call is insignificant. Well, it's ringing right um, now, John. Be... It's co- my voicemail is calling me. Now what? That is correct. Now, you can answer it or not. It makes a difference. Right now, I'm into your voicemail system. I'm now into your contacts list. What I'm looking for, Varney, is I'm looking for something that says Fox Headquarters, Chairman of Fox News, or something, so that I can then call you, which is I'm going to do now on my, my second phone, uh, hang up the phone now because I'm calling you from Fox headquarters. Okay, hang up that phone, All right? Okay. So you should receive a call momentarily from Fox headquarters. There it is, that's right. That's as if the call is coming to me from Fox headquarters, not from you. Absolutely. Well, it went on from there. Um, John, you say that this is what happened at Sony and that they impersonated the FBI who called up people and said, hey, we've got a break in your system, give us your personal uh, passwords, and they did. And you say that's how the Sony hack went down, correct? No, absolutely. It's, uh, all hacks of this nature are a combination of very low technology but a high social engineering factor. So, uh, had so, you, uh, had you answered that call, and the call was from Fox headquarters, uh, your phone said Fox headquarters, right. I would have said something like, uh, hi, this is Zafod Beeblebrox with the Federal Bureau of Investigation. There's been a security breach within the Fox Corporation. We've taken over all communications. Um, to verify your identity, please give us your password. We will give you a brand new password afterwards. Uh, and what is your password, sir, to verify? Half of the people will give up that password. Uh, dozens of people were called simultaneously, and uh, over half the people would have given up the passwords. If you, if you do this properly, almost everyone does. But uh, we then give you a new password, like uh, the new password is uh, I, uh, I-A-M-A-F-O-O-L, like I'm a fool, whatever. Okay. Uh, and then we say, oh, you under no circumstances are you to contact anyone, including co-workers, about this breach until further notice from myself. And so you say during that's that period what of silence, it Sony. only takes you, you, a few minutes, you're saying that's we have how downloaded it, everything. You're saying that's what happened at Sony. That's exactly how it went down. But the White well, House it, says, I, I'm not sure it was the FBI, but certainly it was, it was the impersonation of some government agency or some internal control agency. This is how all hacks of this nature, nature are perpetrated. Um, no, one, no one bothers, uh, Varney, to, to try and... Uh, electronically or through computer technology find out what the passwords and and uh, the safeguards are we go straight to the people and you go to the people through simple tricks like this uh, fi- I find out from your contact list uh, a contact that seems to be someone of authority but well, Sony headquarters or rather Fox headquarters seems to be an authority uh, I call you from that number and 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 the rest is a as a piece of cake. But that means that a again, lot of corporations are open, we, we, and a, a, a lot of corporations, therefore, are very easily hackable using this very low tech approach. Uh, we all thought that absolutely. the big one was going to be some very sophisticated multi computer attack from overseas, maybe that shuts down systems or shuts down the national grid. But this is low tech. This. A lot of people could do it's, this. It's all low-tech. It, it's low-tech except for the social engineering aspect. You have to know how people think, how they react. Uh, that, that We all share common traits of greed and fear and, and ambition. Uh, and using these common traits, we come up with a technique that, uh, that allows you to give us what we need while you think you're helping us or helping the corporation. Now, um, this is, to, this is to, speculation to on your, your part. Your, you don't your, know that this is, this is exactly what happened with Sony. We don't know that. I know, I know this is exactly what happened at Sony. You know this? No, I, I do not know what agency was used, whether it was the FBI, the CIA, or, or an internal agency. But I know for a fact that this is what happened. John, I have to mention that you've got problems with the law. 
a lot of problems with the law Which in the law? past, and um, that declines. I the, have? That, well, that means you've got a credibility problem, doesn't it? Well, what, what law have I had a problem with, Marnie? As I understand it, there were murder charges, wasn't it? And there was some degree of drug taking? Uh, there, I've never had a murder charge, never had a drug charge against me. Um, there were certainly questions in police. The, the police wanted to question me about the murder of my neighbor. I chose not to be questioned. Uh, I was never charged with the murder, uh, never charged with anything. Okay. I'm, I'm back in the States. I've been here for two years with no charges. Um, that's, right. that's the fact. Okay, John, we appreciate you being with us. Um, very, very interesting because we all thought that a major hack would be a very, very sophisticated, high-tech kind of approach, but you're saying it was not. That's fascinating stuff. John McAfee, they, they never I, I, I got to go, but that was good stuff, and we appreciate you being with us. Thank you, John. Thank you, sir.